Ritchie to take over. Tonight's injury report is brought to you by Ortho Virginia, the official sports medicine partner of Loudoun United. No injuries reported for Loudoun. And Zayat still out. So! So, New York gets the first goal. Fourth minute of play. Omar So on the board. Exactly what we're saying. We thought this might be an exciting game. We thought this might be an exciting game. It's great to see them get to the byline and cut one back. Omar So. He's a guy that they talk about over there. They're, they're quite excited about him. He'll be delighted to get that. Let's have a look at this. Young center back, central midfielder, was looking for that professional soccer goal as Tolkien now looks get New York going the other way. Jay is off and running. He's got options in the box. Brings it inside, lays it back for So, who puts it in the back of the net. Omar So, a nightmare for Philadelphia Union 2. His fourth goal in two games against this team. That's just a per picture perfect counterattack from Red Bull 2 there. If you look back earlier, uh, a couple minutes ago, there was a chance uh, in transition where Philly's really playing with fire here. Uh, you know, committing a lot of numbers forward, relieving only two at the back with three Red Bull forwards coming at them. And you can see they got punished here. Great tackle there. Finds Tolkien, who plays it a great ball forward. Like Jay and Torre got a little confused as who was going to hit that. But another really, really good opportunity for Red Bull 2 there to, to try to get another goal on Philly. I'm going to serve it once again. Flicked on at the near post. And Omar Sell's got two already. It was a hat trick last game against Philly Union 2. And in 18 minutes, he's on his way once again here at MSU Soccer Park. Incredible. Absolutely incredible from Omar Sell. He's had him, having himself a day here. He could have, you know, two goals and two assists right now. Two goals. Incredible work from him. Just does so well to get, make that near post run and just flicks it to the near post. Great delivery in here from Lemma. Just guides it right past Freeze and 2 nothing Red Bull 2. Yeah, very good in this one. Of course, Huckabee playing a stretch at center back to start the year and Jaboy Topi. A good Jamaican center back on the bench as So gets by Ofemu and finally finds the back of the net it's been coming and coming and coming throughout this first half it's been posted it's been saves it's been everything but goals and finally omar so puts it in maybe you had a feeling that this red bull team was going to get another opportunity and as much praise as i've been given a famous recently you could see that he did a pretty well, let's just say not a great job in terms of making sure that he was in between the player and got just out-muscled, quite frankly. Got muscled by... Attack. We are into stoppage time of the first half. And Philadelphia answer immediately, and so's on side. He was behind the midfield line. He's 1v1 with the keeper, trying to make it two goals. In three minutes, he chips it over and into the goal. <laughs> New York Red Bulls 2 flying to close this first half. Quite frankly, I don't know exactly what the tuner center backs of the Philadelphia Union were thinking, pushing so high their line, not recognizing that that midfield <laughs> dictates what offsides is and what it isn't. And they just let so right away. You can see how they push up. And he has left. Her goal, Caden Clark, his fifth assist of the season. He is top Four in the USL. And for Clark, his first year at the pro level, almost gets his second, and he will. Omar So, his first hat trick of his soccer career. He is leading New York Red Bulls to back into the win column. Well, it's Clark again. Probably should have been rewarded that third goal, but instead, here on this right hand side with plenty of time. Looks up, finds so, so hot tonight right now. What a good job there by Clark. Just battling the defenders. Just wanted the ball more. Took it to the end line. Being a St. John's alumni, uh, always proud to watch her play and continue to do well in the NWSL. Would you say the greatest soccer graduate from St. John's? Quick ball here. Give you a chance to think about that. Omar So in our goal and ripped it. 
What a goal from the Harrison, New Jersey native. The hometown kid ties it up, and you can see what it means to him. Great goal there by So. Does so well. The great ball in. Does great to take it off the chest and just thumps one in the back of the net. In on goal, question mark maybe, of how he's gonna try and finish that. So he hits a laser off the half volley, quickly taken free kick from Caden Clark in the finish. 20 minutes to play. Flick over the top. Omar So is in, cuts it back over. A, a little bit too heavy of a touch for Korf. Still alive though. Torre now through traffic and right on an open platter for So, and it's 5-1 just like that. Yeah, the ability again of this pretty incredible front three or four, or even the substitutions that come in to give you different looks. Yaya Toure keeping that ball alive, cutting around people, winning 50-50s, being more committed, quite frankly, because that could have been Defend it easily. You get one bite of the cherry. You get another bite of the cherry. That will go the other way. We got one minute of added time for your viewing pleasure. One minute to go in loud season. And New York will back their way into the playoffs. Here's Sue. He finds the back of the net. It's seven to three. We've got ten goals on the evening. And I think that, that spark of energy from New York came as soon as they saw just one minute at data time. I definitely thought there would have been at least two or three minutes with the, a couple injuries that we had. Well, and, and the goals that we've oh, had yeah. scored. Yeah, so what, to one minute is going to be surprising. That, that little bit of extra energy from, from New York probably was like, oh, yes, there's only one more minute left in this match. And all of a sudden they find themselves finding the back of the net. Lynn Family Stadium, and then just call 502 Lou City and get your tickets. Stroud. Bezacor cross along the penalty spot. It's put in. Omar So from Harrison to Louisville and on the score sheet. Giant moment for a man who bleeds red. Arriving late in the penalty box. So times his run to perfection. Stroud. Waiting for Bezikor to develop the run. Jorgensen goes across the face of the goal to the near post, taking Craig and Tosh with him. That'll